Hi, I'm Dr. David Hill and today we're going to be talking about jaundice in infants. Now jaundice is a very common problem in newborns and we should talk about why that is. First of all, jaundice, a yellow color to the skin or the whites of the eyes, is caused by a chemical called bilirubin. Bilirubin is a result of the breakdown of red blood cells, usually uh, in the baby's bloodstream, some by the spleen. Uh, why would a baby break down red blood cells? Well, infants are born with a very high hematocrit. They have a lot of extra red blood cells running around in the bloodstream. They use these blood cells to get oxygen from the mother's bloodstream while they're in the womb. But after the infant is born, they don't need these cells anymore. There's something else special about infant cells, the hemoglobin, the chemical in the cell that I actually grabs that oxygen molecule and carries it around is a little different from adult hemoglobin. We call it fetal hemoglobin and it's a little stickier for the oxygen molecule which is how the baby's blood can steal oxygen from the mother's bloodstream. Fetal hemoglobin also breaks down a little faster than adult form of hemoglobin. So, baby's born, he or she starts to breathe air, they start chewing up all these extra red blood cells and bilirubin is a product of using up these red blood cells. Now what's wrong with bilirubin? Well at low levels it's absolutely fine, it's normal, almost every baby's going to get a little bit jaundiced, but at high levels bilirubin crosses from the bloodstream into the brain where it can cause really serious brain damage. We now know that it's hard to guess what a baby's bilirubin level is just from looking to see how yellow he or she is. So if you notice that your baby is getting yellower in the first few days after birth, bring that to his or her doctor's attention. The doctor can order a bilirubin test at the lab and see very quickly whether the bilirubin is normally elevated or high enough to cause brain damage. Talking about jaundice in newborns, I'm Dr. David Hill.